In this uh, video tutorial, I'll show you how we can use Ad Guard Content Blocker, which is an open source ad blocker for Yandex browser and Samsung Internet browser. We can use it for only two browsers, that is Yandex and Samsung Internet browser. And for this, uh, with this app, we can simply block the ads, and we don't need to even root our device. Also, we can also speed up the uh, speed of uh, searching speed or surfing speed also now for getting the uh, app for this app we'll have to go to play store and then we'll have to search for ad guard content blocker okay now uh, we'll have to install this app by hitting the install button remember to stay connected to Wi-Fi or keep your mobile data on okay i have uh, completely i have completed the download process now i'm installing this app after the installation is complete complete i'll just open the app uh, okay now it's like you're only a couple of steps from uh, fast and clean internet without ads so we just have to click uh, get started here so click on get started now we have to select the browser. To operate AdGuard needs a browser that supports ad blocking technology. This ad blocking technology is supported every only two browsers that is Yandex and Samsung Internet Browser. Okay, select browser. In this video tutorial, I'll show you how we can use Yandex Browser uh, to stop ads. Now I'll just click on Yandex Browser here because I'll just show you how we can stop ads on this browser. Click on Yandex Browser. Okay, now I'll have to uh, download this app. It's a 39 MB app, so I'll just download it uh, and I'll start the installation process. Okay, I have downloaded the Yandex browser and after the download is complete, it's installed. Now I have to open the browser. Okay, here it is. As you can see, the browser is already functional okay with uh, different tabs now i'll just close the browser first because i have to go to the ad card again <laughs> so going back to the ad guard okay uh, we will enable okay we have already selected the browser we have downloaded one of the browsers that is the index browser an appropriate browser was found that is the index browser all that's left is enabling ad guard in its settings we'll enable ad guard here okay so it is uh, disabled we have to en enable it for that we have to click on the ad guard content blocker simply click on it okay it is done it is enabled <laughs> now here are a few settings that is uh, enable syncing login to sync uh, these settings are of uh, index browser these are uh, okay the first setting is enable syncing login to sync your bookmarks and sites on tablet with uh, your other devices we can log in and sync with the bookmarks on sites we can start uh, turbo mode which is uh, uh, which is when your speed is down you can uh, enable the turbo mode uh, to speed up your process like i already told you that you can in, uh, speed up your surfing and uh, searching speed we can enable it or disable it or keep it uh, automatic whenever the speed is low it will just start on its own another is text zoom and auto fit we can just uh, zoom it here the text or keep it auto fit to the screen we can uh, keep it auto fit <laughs> we can ignore sites requests to forbid zoom button going back we have uh, uh, extensions beta version for extension developers search engine search engine is web search simply we can keep it to google uh, i uh, or bing or yahoo india we can uh, i kept it uh, i have selected google here okay it's region i'm from india so the region is india voice search language is automatic okay now here are the uh, privacy settings do we have to save passwords or not autofill forms or not save history secure your connection it's all up to us we can also clear data by clicking on the clear data by simply clicking on the clear data we'll just clear whatever we want to okay just like here i'm uh, clearing all my uh, data which is related to the browser okay 
uh, now here content blocking offensive ad blocker it is already enabled it will uh, uh, block all uh, ads <laughs> and content blocker extensions beta for the uh, blocking of the content we have already used add card content blocker so here it is show recommendations feed start browser from a new tab screen confirm file downloads all the settings are here we can use keyboard for new tab close tabs when we exit the browser that is when we exit from the browser it will also close the apps and switch between tabs by swiping from the edge of the screen from the edge of the screen lower edge okay we can switch between the tabs these are the few settings about yandex browser now going back this uh, was yandex browser going back okay the ad card is already enabled as you can see on the left top uh, no, first we'll see uh, the filters. Filters are here, which are updated on 12th of Jan 746. That is uh, just now. I have updated them. Filters. I'll just click on the three dots button first. I can check for filter updates. Uh, okay, I've already clicked on it. I'll see if there are any filter. Okay, I'm using the most recent version of the filters. Like, what? How I have to filter? Uh, this content blocking method how I have to uh, block my ads there are six filters and rules are for 45,318 I can uh, also go to filters or we can click it here or we can directly click it go to filters okay now we have to check every filter what we are filtering this <coughs> browser from the first is english filter easy list ad card english filter filters list that specifically removes advert the adverts on english language websites uh, the english language websites the uh, this uh, is the content blocker that is used on that we can enable or disable it it is enabled here i can also disable it i can enable it spyware filter the most comprehensive list of uh, various online counters in web analytics tools if you do not want your actions on the internet to be tracked we can keep uh, use this filter and this is something we should do we should try to avoid spyware for this we have to like enable it we should keep it enabled okay social media filter for filtering this uh, for keeping this content away from social media we have to keep this enabled okay annoyances fil uh, filter which is blocks irritating elements on web pages including cookie notice third party widgets and in page pop-ups i like to keep it enabled also okay everything that is irritating on the websites is something we cannot like filter unblocking useful ads filter that unblocks search and self promo ads okay it is good and it should be there then it's upon the uh, if you're russian german japanese uh, whatever you want to do you can keep it russian you can enable russian german japanese dutch spanish turkish experimental filter mobile ads filter filter for all known mobile ad networks you can keep it on safari filter you can just read about it it's special fi fi uh, filter for safari 9 plus uh, on ios and os x we need a separate filter for safari because it does not fully support our role syntax a b pindo this all is given here we can use any of the uh, any of the filters we can enable them by simply clicking on them so uh, we can first study about the filters we can just un understand what the filter is saying and then we can enable it okay this was all about the filters now here as you can see it's applicable for two browsers yandex and samsung i'm star showing it on yandex so i have downloaded yandex browser only i can just start uh, click on the start here i can just start here and start surfing without uh, that is ad free i can just simply start surfing without any ads going back uh, to the ad card because i have to continue with the app get started two conditions have to be met for ad, ad card to work you need to use a browser that supports content blocking technology which are two browsers are supported here yandex and samsung internet browser ad cards must be enabled in the browser's content blocking settings which we did in the very uh, first step now going to the left top there are many other options we like to uh, take a look first is the settings option 
uh, auto update filters do you have to op update filters or not we should keep it on uh, we should keep it enabled we should update the filters or you can keep it the way you want to uh, because filters are important for blockage of uh, advertisements update only over Wi-Fi I have uh, kept it for both Wi-Fi and uh, mobile data we can keep it to only Wi-Fi by just enabling it filters select uh, what filters we want to use we can just uh, simply do that that is something I have already showed you okay this was uh, on the left of uh, settings now the filters which we already checked and then we have a user filter if we want to use a filter on our own we can just uh, add a filter for example we can add rule or import input a filter we can just uh, click on the import one and uh, write uh, uh, a URL we can just copy and paste it here I'll just uh, uh, I'll just write one URL okay for you guys to understand you can just simply copy and paste it okay I wrote uh, this URL of google.com okay so many filters I'll just uh, click any one of it okay So this was uh, importing, uh, importing uh, this um, uh, filter, user filter, and then we can just delete it or uh, do uh, or just cross it from the list. Okay, this was the user filter. We can also add some rules here. Okay, check for filter updates. We can check for them as we are already using the latest updates. We don't have to uh, check for it. Two filters have been uh, updated. Uh, okay, two filters have been updated already. I checked for the updates again. We can ra uh, rate ad card here. We can report a bug about this app. We can just report it. We have the GitHub's report also now. We can uh, read about this app for, to know more about the ad card content blocker. We can just hit the about button. Okay, we can rate it. It's the version 1.8.0. Uh, uh, Okay, official site is adgar.com, forum.adgar.com, source code is github.com, okay. Uh, it's a free software and you can redistribute it or modify it under the terms of general public license. It's published by Free Software Foundation, either version 3 of the license, any later version. I hope uh, with this uh, tutorial you'll be able to protect yourself from all the irritating ads and any kinds of ads you want to. You just simply have to download this app and the browser it supports. Only two browsers here, are, uh, here will help you to... Uh, avoid uh, ad ads that is the index browser and Samsung internet browser so uh, help yourself and uh, keep yourself away from ads I hope this tutorial was, was useful to you thank you so much